What's up? It's Memorial Day weekend episode. That's right. Tons of stuff going on. Tons of stuff to show you. Different products we're going to try out for the first time. But first of all, I want to let you know that today's episode is sponsored by Robertson Family Water. You guys know that I had some kidney stone issues and I got my water checked and it got, it was like disgusting. It had chlorine, it had limestone in it. It was just nasty. Well, now we have like a whole house system and not only is the water great, I have no more kidney stone pain, but guess what? Our clothes, that's right, my wife's like, you know what I like most about our new water? I said, what? I can smell the detergent in my clothes. I'm like, really? I said, well, I have to tell you, in the shower, my soap lathers up like twice as much. So we don't have a bunch of crap in our water anymore. If you guys are interested in getting a free home test, contact Robertson Family Water. You just wanna buy a home system. They can ship it to you anywhere in the United States. You guys ready to do some ribs, ribs, and more ribs? That's right. So come on in close. Let me show you everything we're gonna do, and then we'll take you outside and start grilling. And as you guys know, I got my special rub mix here for some of the ribs as a backup plan in case this stuff is not good. This I caught on the road. It's a place called Jim Oliver's Smokehouse, all natural, old fashioned, whatever. Bourbon infused barbecue sauce. Now this better be good because I paid like 11 bucks for this. All right, here we go. Little bone spoon. I don't like it. I'm not putting that anywhere near my meat. That tastes really bad and I just wasted $11. So sour is okay. Tangy sour is okay. But when, when something tastes sour bad, that's what this is. All right, well the exciting thing today is <laughs> the rib rack. We're gonna use a rib rack. If you've never used one before, I've never used one. I've always put them in circles and stabbed them with skewers, but I got this rib rack from Char Griller, and we're gonna put on the acorn that they sent to the show, and we're going to use the rib rack and see how it works. I got three racks of beef ribs. One, two, three. And I got two racks right here. One, two. There you go. There it is, guys. The Char Griller Acorn Kamado. We're gonna get the fire started right now. Okay, Tammy just called me and reminded me that she doesn't eat ribs. Oh, I've been forgetting for 18 years. So I got our top sirloin right over there. We'll put that on too. Let's get our smoking stone on. Just gonna put that in there right now. Pop it in there. Okay, grills on all in place. And where's our uh, rib rack? All your racks. Beef, pork, pork, beef, beef. It's a full house. Ha! <laughs> All right, and then I got some boneless meat in there off the top of the rib rack. Okay, guys, so my buddy Jeff just arrived, and he's, you're, you said you were hungry? I am very hungry. Awesome. All right, so we're going to do the ribs. Uh, let me show you. The beef ribs just came off, and my wife's steaks just came off, and they look amazing. This held at 250 perfectly, didn't it? It did. Uh, unbelievable. The egg corn Kamado is really, the more I use it, uh, the more I'm loving it. So let me show you the beef right now. Pork is still going, but the beef is done. Go ahead and just, you want to use your fingers to tear it apart? Sure. You want, let's see how tender it is. Don't burn yourself. All right. So show them down here. Show them the rib. Can you see that, guys? Look at that. That just came right apart. All right, I'm going to pull mine real quick. Look. Ow, 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 hot, hot, hot. It's not hot, Jack. It's not that hot. But look at that. Is that perfect? Are right, you ready to try this? Yes. All right, let's do it. Mm. Help me out. Mmm. Excellent. This is only the beef. Whoa. You're gonna have to leave because mm. uh, I'm thinking about eating all these by myself. It's okay, I got two more racks <laughs> over there. So we have now come to the second rack of ribs. It's, it, it's sitting here cooling but we're gonna find out where our friend is. Can you hear me? Oh, yeah. Hey, where are you? I'm headed that way. You're headed that way? Yeah. What time is it? Five o'clock. Uh, I'm looking at 512, dude. Oh, 512, okay. I got a beautiful rack of ribs in front of me. How long will it take you to get here? Uh, where you live? 
I'll have to tell you off camera we're filming right now. <laughs> so I just cut my half off? Well, yeah, cut it in half first if you want, and then cut a rib <laughs> off that. I don't care. How about we just cut over here? No, no, cut it in half right there. Cut in half? Oh, man. Yeah, he gets the smaller half. He's late. Uh oh. Dude, you're on camera and you're missing it. I know it. There it is. <laughs> there it is. It's sliced right through. Well, you can't tell because it looks so beautiful. All right, don't stab me now. I'm going to show the meat. Guys, look at that. Look at that. Smoke ring, everything. Beautiful. Is that your rib we're going to try? Look at that, man. Bird and hot. Awesome. Can I pick it up? Yes. We're family, right? Yes. All right, good. There it is, guys. Look at that. Hot, 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 hot. Looks all awesome, right. Jack. It's Time all, to eat. Is, I don't know. Is it still piping hot? It won't matter. All right, let that cool for a second. Just one second. Your, your mouth's watering. <laughs> He's drooling all over my floor. All right, before we try this, uh, sorry, Chris, you didn't make it on the show, but I got ribs for you when you get here. He's going to be late. I got to go work out. So uh, the acorn Kamado is amazing. It held perfect at 250. Char Griller, thank you so much for sending that. I really appreciate it. Guys, check out their website. They have smokers. They have gas grills. They have pellet smokers. And they got that acorn. $2.99 for that. Unbelievable. All right, guys. Here we go. Works we're gonna awesome. Get his, we're going to get it. You ready? Yes. Try it. I can't wait to see. Is it too hot? No? Oh, he didn't have a problem with that. Look at the juice is dripping off of that. Oh, the bone came clean, dude. Sweet. Um, can you stop just so we can get your input? Just let them know. Let them know how it is. Just try to describe it. I think I'm moving in. Oh, dear Lord. A Absolutely excellent. Comes right off the bone. God, no, no, he's not, not living here. He's not living here, really. Oh, I'm sorry. Really? No. <laughs> Oh, man, I brought my bags, too. <laughs> well, you can sleep in the backyard. No, absolutely excellent. Um, comes right off the bone, so there's absolutely going to be no waste. Um, tender, melts in your mouth, easy to chew. Like I said, it's just awesome. Absolutely awesome. All You're right. my hero. Thank you, man. Thank you very much. All right, and he was early, by the way, just so you know. Jeff, thanks for being on the show. Guys, I love you. I'll see you on the next episode. Say goodbye. Goodbye. Thank you. Bye.